when you exercise your spirit and the Holy Ghost arises inside of you you will know because sometimes he will now begin to lay scriptures on your heart scriptures you will drop them he can drop short sentences on your heart short sentences when you when you notice that it means he has risen up when he rises up sometimes he can he can give you a song stop praying in tongues start singing that singing that song start singing that the last song he gave me he gave me the song in the morning i sang it till night yes sang it till night the next meeting that i went to preach it was as if i was in, i was an invincible man when he rises yield whenever you discern what he's doing stop doing your own stuff and begin to do what he's doing let me give you an example we stand and worship you i want to sing the song he's singing in my spirit in the realms of the angels we stand and worship you in the realm of the angels just watch me we stand and worship you don't make it just in the realm of the earth. don't go to the lower octaves you stand and worship you in the realm of the angels we stand and worship you in the realm of the angels we stand and worship you in the realm of the angels we stand and worship you in the realm of the angels we stand and worship you now listen so i picked something he has risen so when he rises that's when he can speak but you will need to yield what you notice he's doing do with him then he will begin to speak are you there the third edition of the school of prophets i'm going to take you through the protocol step by step and all of us will hear so what he said is that there's somebody in the congregation that is giving the gift of prophecy don't believe me no wait we're in practicals don't believe me in the realm of the angel we stand and worship you now bring that person in the realm of the angel we stand and worship you. Are you still with me? You are not with me, you are distracted. Oh, oh, oh. Let me tell you something. If you are going to be strong in the spirit, you must have immunity to distraction. If any small thing can move you, you are not strong. If which is content with you, they will stir up your environment against you. If you cannot focus, you have lost. Now, you notice I did not shout. I did not shout. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No. Is your spirit alive? In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. In the realm of the angels, realm of the angels. We stand and worship you in the realm of the angels, of the angels. Oh, 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 oh. in the realm of the angels, yeah. we stand and worship you in the realm of the angels. Oh, oh, oh. in the realm we stand and worship in the realm of the angels. In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship in the realm of the angels. We stand and worship. In the realm of the angels, 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 we stand and worship.
Now listen. Are you with me? Just doing what he's doing. That means I prefer what you are doing than what I am doing. So I join you. Then he will start rising. He will start enlarging himself. He will start warring against your enemies. Oh, oh. I waited all through yesterday during the meeting. I couldn't sense the angel that the Lord sends to work with me. But that angel is here now. Now, don't believe me. Don't, don't believe me. <laughs> Ooh, don't believe me. All right. Um, as a sign. As a sign that that angel has come. This is not a leading. I'm just telling you. I want to open the door for angelic activity. Now, I'm not. You are not following me. There, there are dimensions of authority I have in the spirit anytime that messenger comes. For instance, the fire of God will come upon seven people in this congregation from my left hand side to my right hand side to the back of the hall. Seven people will come under the influence of the fire of the Holy Spirit right here, right here. They are. Oh my God. Oh my God. Listen. As I speak to you, someone is already healed. I can see someone healed from an abdominal condition. Where is that sister? Come, sister. Yeah, come. Come. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I ask that you put your hand on your servant. Put your hand on your servant and bless the seed that she carries. Let the anointing come upon that seed that she's carrying. Yes, let, let it come stronger in the name of Jesus. Please handle her very well, okay? Now you can receive your miracle anywhere you are. Oh my God. Oh my God. Put your hand where you need that miracle right now. Eyes for the miracles of the eyes. Ears for the miracles of the ears. Put it where the pain is, where the tumor is, where the cancer is. Put it right there. And the hand of God will come upon you right now. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I take authority over sickness. Oh my God. They, they cancel us. Have they released those people? Okay, they've not released them, so we can pray. We need those guys to join us before we begin to pray. So while we wait for them, we'll give them two minutes to get ready. While we wait for them, I'll ask the Holy Spirit to be anointing some people. All right, all right. I already see five people in the congregation. You are called into the office of the prophet and the Lord will anoint you. Lord, anoint the prophets. Put the anointing on the prophets. Put the anointing on the prophets. Activate the capacity. Activate the gift. Activate the gift. Activate the gift. In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. Listen to me, listen. Twelve years ago, there's someone in the congregation. Twelve years ago, you received a call from God, and it's twelve years ago. Okay, bring that lady. I don't need to continue. Why will you receive a calling from God and refuse to execute it? Bring her. Bring her. I need to empower her. Because you, you have to go and begin to do the will of, the, of God. We stand and worship you. 
in the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. In the realm of the angels, we stand and worship you. I'm seeing somebody in the congregation. From what I see here, you are you are a footballer. And I don't know what happened that seems to cut off your career. I'm seeing somebody like a, a footballer. I'm seeing you with a ball, so. Anybody here in this congregation, you do ball games professionally. Any footballer here? Come here. What is it that wants to cut short your career? Come, come, come. In the realm of the angels, and which the land and worship What What happened to you? Okay. In the realm of the angels, 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 now what I'm saying is strange, even me myself, I don't understand it. But I'm seeing a woman, a woman, yeah? And this woman had a child, female, a daughter. But she lost the child. She lost the child. She had a daughter, she lost the, the child. And even though it's been a while, she's not fully healed from that situation. Now, can that woman come to me? Come here, right now. Oh my God. Oh my God. In the realms of the angels, we stand and worship you. In the realm, you, there is a blessing that the Lord wants you to receive tonight. Bring her, bring her. In the realm of the angels. I bless you in the name of Jesus. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. The Lord says I should tell you that he has not abandoned you. He says I should tell you that he's going to compensate you. He's going to compensate you. He also says I should tell you that he will begin to encounter you like never before. He said weep not. Weep not because I have not forgotten you. Weep not because I am with you and I will compensate you and show you my mercies. Yeah, his hand is upon you now. It's okay, 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 it's okay. Oh my God. Can we pray for this mother? Can we pray for her? That the comfort of the Lord will come upon her right now. Oh God. God. Oh God. Look kindly on your handmaid. Look kindly on your handmaid. Oh. Let there be compensation. Make all things new. Do something for her that will take away the pain. In the name of Jesus. I ask that you give your servant a gift, a, a gift, a gift, a gift, a gift, give her a gift, wipe away her tears, wipe away her tears, in the name of Jesus, I bless you, 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 I bless you.
Okay. In the realms of the angels, and angels. Oh, the things I see are strange. Oh, there's fire on somebody there. Bring that person. Bring the person. Now listen. Listen. Oh. As you are well aware, the fire she's speaking about is not physical fire. Indeed, there's fire. Be present. I can attest to that. There's fire. Now, since the people that have gone for counseling have joined us, please yield to him. <laughs> In the realm of the angels. Can you spend a moment stirring your spirit? <laughs> Manifestation you are seeing here is just because I decided to yield to sing the song of the spirit. Then he finds liberty, he begins to enlarge himself, he begins to enlarge himself in our company. Exercise your spirit, exercise your spirit anywhere you are. Sante Babogo Balase Ronde Bobosi Cabrande Curia Balabas and Terminole Exercise your spirit. We are on a ride with the Holy Ghost.
We stand and worship you in the realm of the angels. Of power in your spirit, you must be intentional about stirring up that capacity, stirring up that deposit, stirring up that investment. The hand of God is upon your life. Stir up the power of the Holy Ghost in your spirit. God wants to do something mighty from your life with your life. It's not by might, my friends. 
is by the Spirit of God. Turn him loose in your spirit. And the things that seem to be impossible will be made possible. Oh my God. In the realm of the angels. In the realm of the angels. Listen, listen, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I just had a vision, I just had a vision, and in my vision, I saw a young lady, a young lady in this congregation, a young lady in this congregation, this lady has found favor with God, you have found favor with God. And the Lord will invest an anointing on your life. He will invest an anointing. He will invest an anointing. He will invest an anointing. There is an anointing. There is an anointing. Oh my God. There is an anointing upon the land. It's an investment from heaven. It's an investment from heaven. The hand of God is upon you.
Now, I want to pray for the sick in a moment of time. You need to go home with your miracle. And by 11 a.m., for those of you that can make it, we will continue from where we stopped. Since they have joined us, I'm going to continue my miracle prayer. As I do the miracle prayer, so many encounters will be taking place. Just open your spirit. So many things. Things that you have lost will be restored. All kinds of stuff. Oh my God, I'm seeing this vision again. Listen. I'm seeing a vision. I'm, I, 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 I try to run away from it, but I can't run away from it. There's a Nigerian here. You are a Nigerian. Your father died and you went for a burial. And you went for that burial this year. Somewhere around mid year. Mid year. Somewhere around um, May, June, mid year. So you went for that burial. And unknown to you, you were bewitched during the time of the burial. A spell was cast on you. When you came back from that burial, so many things started going wrong in your life. Since you got back from that burial. Please, where is that person? Nigeria. The person I'm talking about is Nigeria. You went for the burial this year. Somewhere towards the mid of the year. And the moment you got back from the burial, you did not know that you were bewitched. Strange things began to happen. Can you put a microphone on his mouth? Let him tell us the strange things he's talking about. Just uh, meanwhile, meanwhile, when when was this barrier? Uh, July. July, okay. Okay. Go on. The, are you aware that you are bewitched? You are not aware. Okay. So what are the things that you have noticed since you you, you got back? Just unnecessary expenditures. Expenditures and all of that. Find out from her. When was the burial you went for? You went, okay, in June. What did you notice when you got back? Um, my whole family. Yes. Everybody was sick. Everybody was sick. You are the one I'm talking about. But wait, wait, wait. I will pray for all of you. Yes, what happened again? My son. Your son? Who is a footballer. Who is a footballer? Everything went down. Everything went down. Um, we will not talk about witchcraft today. Maybe the next school of prophets will let analyze it and pray some prayers. I know those, the Americans in our midst, you don't believe there's anything like witchcraft, but, but just stay with me, stay with me, and we'll walk ourselves through, through the scriptures. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes, what happened? When did you go for the burial? July. July, okay. What did you notice when you got back? Uh, well, before I went, I've been having issues with uh, renewal of my contract, and that hasn't... It hasn't happened. Okay, wait. So, I'll just touch you. Can I touch you? Okay. Can I touch you? Just touch you here and touch you here. Okay. All right. So, Lord, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I ask, that one that is under besiegement, that a spell was casted upon, I ask, oh God, let your anointing descend upon that individual so that I will know who among these ones you were talking about.